היזום. נאו. 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 And this is a very serious topic that I would like to talk about um, today. Um, we as the Sippers have built a platform based on something. And that something is called receipts. Um, and so we always say no receipts, no tea. And so we always talk about stuff. But one thing about Sippers, we like to come together. And we like to help somebody when we can. And if something is going on and we... can help them we like to if we can and we like to try to help and try to be stuff, stuff when they deal with children the community and stuff like that we like to do that we have sippers we sip we messy we all this stuff like that but we still have a heart and so um and so so we like we have a heart Let me see if I can send her my life. All right. So, earlier today, a young woman uh, by the name of Elisha, Alicia came on the live. And she told us a, a story of how she was going through. Hey, y'all. How y'all doing? She was going through a... She was having some heart issues And she had needed a heart transplant um, The heart transplant That she needed um, She was getting money from GoFundMe for, To support the heart transplant And other things in her life But they took her GoFundMe down And we don't know why um, She also talked about The fact that she so And she talked about these things And in her own words She was going through a lot of stuff dealing with not only the GoFundMe but trying to get just basic things like her medication and things like that. Um, she ended up talking to Tutu and Tutu contacted me. She came on the live and she told us a story that touched our heart. And so like I said, Sippers, we are um, oh let me add her. So we are people, we messy but we are black people, community and things like that when we came. So um, thank you for joining live. I had a chance to go through um, some of the things that you were showing me as far as what was going on. And I appreciate you coming and telling us uh, your story. Um, she's okay. Currently, she's currently Let me say this. this. What's going on? Okay. So Tutu was saying, all right, there's got people saying that, like I was saying earlier, that I was lying about my situation. They're like, you going out, you had a drink. I'm, I'm, I'm a person that's dealing with an autistic child. I'm stressed out. I know I'm not supposed to be drinking. I haven't drunk in months. Like I said, I had one drink, and I'm just like, they basing off of all that shit. I told you, too, it's just making me cry even more because y'all basing off my life story on just uh, me going out having a fucking drink. These people, me, these people, the doctors are telling me, I might be dead in a couple of months, and you mean to tell me one fucking drink is going to fucking hurt? I mean, I know, but, it's, not, I know it's not good for the but, heart. But, but sister, what about the smoke out? Huh? The smoke out. Who, no, that was for my best friend. She oh. told me to post that for her. I don't smoke. Oh. She told me to post that that wasn't going to be at my house. That was going to be at her house. She told me I had more followers than her. So she said, Frankie, you post my smoke out for me. Because, okay. you know, you got, so you I know you got people that probably smoke and so might you, won't go. But so I don't smoke. I don't drink like that. So, so you didn't attend the smoke out? No, I didn't attend the smoke out. I, I'm, why would I, if I don't smoke, I'm not going to a smoke no, out. I got you. Like so for my sister, I them, my your, sister I them looked smoke your, weed. I looked, I looked at your stuff. It's a lot like of I stuff. have proof Bronx, on Bronx my Bronx condition. Bronx I have proof on my condition. Heart failure. Heart failure. Exasperation. Fibrillation. Yeah, I you was explaining to Tutu. She was like, what's the need of the heart transplant? Diabetes. Hypertension. Yes, fluid, all that, yes. all, all that all deals that. with the heart. Yes. And you and you managed to shake down at the D shop. You telling me you have a bad lung, bad heart, hypertension, blood pressure, yeah, but... insulin, and you managed to be shaking down at the D shop. That, well, not, I just that, like I said, shaking. I was you? just, is that you, I was sister? stressed out at is the moment. Is that you, sister? Right there, is that you shaking? I mean, busting it open, girl. 
bop, bop, biggie, 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 biggie. I know, but that's why I said everybody want me to just. Oh, that's why I just the, told my friend oh, today. Oh, it was after the, that. I say I'm just gonna go on social media, and I'm just gonna disappear. And, so, you, so listen, you set you set up for a GoFundMe. You set up for a Facebook. Um, this is the receipt, sister. I have the receipt now. You oh no, I already for, know. I already know. So like I didn't got screenshots of people. You said, uh, you have a, so you have a GoFundMe, you set up a, a Facebook, and you asked for Instagram, but all three of them was different amounts. No, they canceled. They canceled a, that, They canceled a Facebook one. But that's the first one I did. I did it on Facebook at, at, at first. And once they didn't go nowhere on Facebook, the Facebook one got deleted. So that's when I doubled back and made the GoFundMe. I deleted the Facebook, um, the Facebook, um, which campaign? Because that one didn't move either. People had donated, but they didn't move. So I made it's, it go funny. It's, it's three different campaigns. Was... It's three different campaigns with all different amounts. One for five, one for six, and one for eight. And then you told us on here. It was no, I don't have a campaign for but eight. Listen, sister, the Facebook one thing. was for my five, research, too. But listen, so listen. Hold up, sister. Let me, let's get into this. So my research tells us this is how much a heart transplant costs in this country. Just over 400000 The cost can be the average, on other hand, can cost about $1.4 million. So listen, what kind of heart was you getting? The one, the discount heart? Was you getting a heart? Man, I know one, I can't. I know, know I can't request four thousand. I can't request that kind of heart. heart. If the cart you was getting cost five thousand dollars, sister, that must be a rich heart. A rich no, heart I heart. wasn't saying the five thousand dollars. I was saying to go to get to the doctor to go towards the transplant. I know damn well nobody not about to send me no four million dollars. Okay, so listen. I know they ain't gonna send me no four it's million dollars. Four hundred thousand. So listen, I just want to know what kind of heart. So listen, because it's not adding up. It's just not making sense. This is you. So the one of the dates that you showed us that you actually went to the hospital, according to the receipt, was this same date you posted this post. And this is the date you went for a, 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 a lung thing. You was all right? Huh? This, this, this is a post from your page. And it's dated actually the same exact date that you actually went to the hospital for type two I only went to the hospital to get fluid off. No, okay. that's from Oxner. I go to UMC. But it, it has, it I has could get the receipts from UMC Hospital. Oh, so that's okay. from Oxner Hospital. The, but the dates is the same, sister. That's what I'm saying. Yeah, the dates could be the same. I wasn't admitted that day. I was let go that day because that was that was just some. I just went in for fluid, and that was it. When I get admitted to the hospital, that's when it's farther than the fluid. It's dealing with the heart congestive failure. Like right now, I'm in here for pneumonia. So they're keeping me. I'm in here for the pneumonia now. So they're keeping me. They, they're saying I got to stay. I can't go home. Like, they're like, okay. you can't go home. So, so this is a I know the this stuff is a that the people are sending, this they didn't picture. send it all to me. This is a picture of you at school. They're only going to say that because that's why I'm saying. I'm to the point where I just told my family it is what it is. Y'all just do what y'all got to do once whatever happened. Like mm -hmm. I said, I'm over the money situation. Like, that's why I left the cafe and the people say what they say. I got the documentation. When I get home, the, the documents from UMC, so from my whole doctor, I'm, I'm going to send it to The date's not lining up. This is a picture of you at school taken September 16, 2019. September 2016, 2019, you was, in, you was admitted to Ajna for congestive heart failure? So no, not Ajna. I was, Tutu was asking me my, she was asking me my, what diagnosis I had. So since um, I should have had all the diagnosis up there, that's why I went to their to the hospital account and got it from them. Because I don't have an account with UMC. That's my normal hospital right there. That's my hospital where I, I see treatment for my congested heart failure. I don't have an account with them. That's where it all started at, at Oxygen. I was showing, I was showing to two. And, and you didn't attend the smoke up. The smoke up. Huh? And you didn't attend the smoke up. No, I did not attend that smoke out. She didn't even have it. But you did she didn't even have the smoke out. But you did attend the, the, the shakedown and the DJ and everything else. Yeah, somebody screenshot that and sent that to me. And was like, you need to stop whatever you're doing as far as going out and stuff like that because people are making it bad on you that knowing that you're sick. But by them seeing you doing what you're doing, that's what's the make-believe come in at. So that's why I told... My family, after today, is no more social media for me 
because I know they had them type of people out there that was doing it. So I'm just like, I'm just over it. And I told my family, I'm done with it. They're making fun about the situation. So that's why I told her that if I die to death tomorrow, I got a whole list. Yeah. I have a whole list. Because yeah. I already know I have every screenshot. The same okay. thing you got, I have already. Right. So what I'm It's not that I'm lying about my sickness. I understand where you coming from so as why far as go, so, going out so and all that. If my research is telling me that GoFundMe took it down because you were, failed to provide documentation about your condition. I sent and when they said that I sent them the documentation. I sent them the documentation dealing with my with, with my conditions on them. They told me they have to look into it. I mean, what do you want me to rush the people? I can't do nothing. Either they, if they're going to send it back, the man said they're going to email me back and go from there. Sister, and I not, left it at that. So for a heart transplant, it's not easy. They got people on the way. It's not like, easy. Like, I didn't look this shit up. Hold I didn't did got different shit this, from everybody. Like, it's too this. much. It's a lot. Check it out. So I'm to the for point where. So if you are in line for a heart transplant and you need between five and $400,000, and you're telling me that your doctors who want to, of course, give you the heart transplant, not only just to make their money. They don't want to give me. That's why they're saying what they're saying. They're telling me there's nothing else they can do. The doctors over here saying the same thing. They say, Ms. Jackson, there's nothing so else they, they have, can do. So do they have a heart, heart for you? <laughs> no. No, that's the thing. With a heart transplant, you have to get tests done through the heart doctor itself over here first before they can even transfer all that even to your to, to the heart transplant place like i didn't went through all this with my heart doctor i couldn't upload the stuff because he told me it's confidential and he told me if i upload the conversation that i can get sued and all this kind of stuff and i'm just like well i need documentation he got documentation with me with my heart condition on my documentation he told me i have to go through steps to get to the heart transplant. That's the part that he's trying to work on. Wow. I had a heart attack last year, and that's how I got the heart defibrillator in my chest. I got the heart defibrillator May 17th, two days before my little nephew's birthday. I got the heart um the heart defibrillator. So you know what that man told me? That's a waste of the heart being there. That's a waste of the defibrillator being there. So I'm just over it. I'm I'm just so listen, done, and I'm just like you can't get sued for your information. The doctor would never tell you that's com that's your information. It's confidential for him to release. It's confidential for me. That's to what release, I'm saying. But it's not I'm telling him, I want it for my records. I want to be talking about so me posting time, the video and stuff time, like that. So at this point in time, do you have any type of document? Matter of fact, that's a private example. Remember with Super when she got her surgery and all that, and she was like, they really went called her doctor. Tell them to go call my doctor if they really want to know about the heart transplant the and my heart condition. No doctor. Well, his no. name is Dr. Frank at UMC Hospital. Tell the them call him if they really want to know. The doctor ain't going to give us no information. The doc, you she said the they call her doctor and asked her about her surgery. Dr. Tommy C. Frank, UMC. He also a pastor. That's the same one, white man? Huh? Dr. Frank, a white man? Uh, yeah, he's Dr. Frank at uh, UMC Hospital. He's a... he's a Like, that's my heart doctor. That's, what's, that's who I see dealing as dealing with my heart. Like, he's trying to work with that. And all he's doing is giving me heart medication. That's it. Like, he ain't... I, I, everybody, this one girl, this lady, she's telling me go to Texas because the doctor's down here. You can tell them about a heart transplant. All you want, they, do, they will not try to go... They he, a go man. he a Chinese man or a white man? He a white man. I had a video up with him on my page. Yeah. And I got the video. I can send it yeah. to you. No, that's not Dr. Frank. His name is Dr. Frank Smart. His name is Dr. Frank Smart. Okay. I'm telling you, they don't just jump the transplant. I've been jumping... Since I had my heart surgery, I've been fighting to tell these people, if y'all telling me I have congested heart failure and the fluid and the heart is enlarged and there's no more that you could do, what you think the next step from the heart that you already have? I Meaning, if they can't do nothing with the heart I got, that is trying, that is saying, like, I need a new heart. 
So listen. If I don't have a normal heart size, you that that's not good. That's Check not it good. Check it out. So what's that end up is this? Huh? So what's that end up is this? Huh? So what's that end up is this? It ain't me. It is what it is. This is what it is. Because people, and it's like, because this is when I end up. None of, none of these dates, what you send me, is matching. No, I didn't try to send you the date shake it. I the sent you there, all the conditions the I have. There, you, it's like you went to the hospital, you went to the doctor and complained of this, and then you had the club that night complained that. And not saying that you can't go to the club. If you want to go to the club, that's on you. But at the same time, if you have the tenacity and energy to go to the club, you have the tenacity and energy to say, hey, send my stuff to the GoFundMe so I can get my money. At the same time, what would you have to do too? This I'm, I'm not Oprah. I I don't have a billion dollars. I can't do like that. But what I can say is this: you have to take onus of your situation too. You feel what I'm saying? Right. You have to take onus of your situation too. If you uh, you're a legend to us that your child, we don't know. I don't know. I don't play with children. I don't want to talk about children. We're not going to talk about children. But I have an autistic son, so I I can empathize with you on that. And you have that gives you reason to want to live. Okay, so if you have a reason to want to live, which is your son, then you have to take owners of what it is. And so what happens mm -hmm. is... So you don't have to see it anymore, treasure. Bye. Well, so what I'm saying is that this is this this is just not end up. Not that I don't know if you have a heart. When I, I get the information from UMC, I'm going to send you the receipt. I already know how it goes. I got updated. I just got out the hospital from UMC two weeks ago. I got updated receipts. I just don't have an account with their hospital. Like, I have to get an account with them for all my hospital visits, all that. They show you all your stuff online. Like, they got an account now to where you, they show you when you've been discharged, the medication you on, and all that. So when I get the account from UMC, it's going to be updated, and it's going to show you. I only got that from optional because Tutu was asking me what was my conditions that I am have of what I'm going through. And they had a list up there. And that's why no, I sent no, it to no. you to show you the list, no, 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 no. not the dates. I was trying to show you the conditions I had. Right. So check this out. I do appreciate you coming. You heard me? But at this time, I'm not being part of it. Because what I'm seeing... It's okay. It's enough. okay. I'm not tripping. If you have it's some, okay. If you have some stuff, other stuff, you could try to talk to somebody else. But I'm not a doctor. I'm not a medicine person. I'm just a Oh, person no. Person. I know. She was saying talk to you, not like to, 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 like to do nothing, just to hear you out. It's okay. I'm not. I'm not about. I'm not upset about that situation because I, I've been. That's, that's why I said the screenshots been getting sent to me for I don't know how long. That's why I told my my, um, my daddy. I just have my daddy said you need to just get off social media because it's just gonna kill you even more. Like it's too much, and he said all the extra stuff you're doing is just not making you look good at all. Right. Like I just like I said, you say it's not a good thing. You know what I'm saying? I'm just saying being cooped up in the house. I'm just trying to see what it's going to solve or what it's going to do. And I'm like, if I do do this, then what's this going to change? I'm dying either way it goes. And, you know, people keep telling me that Everybody's dying that social media going to tell you down. They're going to drag for you. And they really is dragging. That's what they're doing. They're really sending my, but you understand around, why my videos you understand and all why You understand why? Yeah, I understand why. That's why I said I told you, too, I wanted to talk to Shake It and hear you out because I already knew what type of day it is. Yeah, I'm he even to told me, Shaky going to tell you down. He going to make you look bad and something it's, like that. Especially when you're trying to say, okay, send us money, send me money, help me out, do whatever, pray for me, try to help me do stuff. If you're playing on people's sympathy and this is not accurate, yes, I will. I will. Right, and but I, can, that, I, have, I can't do and nothing all about I can, it. And so what I'm saying, what's in front of me is showing me that you're not being honest completely about what's going on. That's what's in front of me. And there's no cap on it. I don't care what nobody say about it. This is what I'm saying. You're coming and say, well, look, feel sorry for me. To Listen, I have an autistic child that I've never asked for a dollar for. But at the same time, I'm saying, you're saying, help me out. This is going on. This is what's going on. But the only thing that's in front of me and the only thing you come in and say, okay, well, this is what happened. So if somebody come and say, listen, I'm about to. Well, I'm, I can't I'm, send you that a document because I'm not home. When I get home, I'm going to send it to you and then I'm going to just leave it at that. But. You know, this will be my last day on social media. I'm going to, I have to vent because no, 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 no. it's tearing me down. It's tearing me down. And I told my daddy, once I die, I I, I, I might even have That's a private not... funeral because they're going to have a lot of people there that was dressed for me. How, hold up. So, okay, okay, nigga. Thank you so much. Maybe social media not for you. So that's. And I'm not I'm... God. I'm not God. But you ask somebody for, uh, you here's your cash app. It says, my cash app is this. What are you talking about? 
If you asking me for if you asking me, sippers, sip anybody that's not a sipper, if you're asking me, saying, okay, listen, I'm going through this, help me out. I don't have a problem doing it. I don't have a problem posting it. I don't have a problem doing what? You can say that. I don't have a problem with that at all. I will and, and guess what? I will go to the moon to help you. But don't tell me, listen, help me, send me money. This is and it's the receipt. The receipt. Hold on. You're telling me, look, my cash app is L E five oh four. You're telling me, help me send me money. Tell your people, send me money because I'm going through this. That's fine. That's fine. Help me, I'm going through this. Hey, when you ask somebody for and that's cool. As a community, we're supposed to help you and stuff like that. But don't tell us help you and then you telling me the day you went to the hospital, that night you was back at the club, wiggling. I'm not saying that that's wrong or right, but heart failure is something that is very serious. What you're, and so me looking to him, like, well, what's this about? Okay, cool. That's okay. You can go shake your hands if that's what you want to do if you're having a heart issue. But what you're saying is not enough. And nothing you provided to me. You have given me, she gave me all receipts of herself that talk about stuff that is extremely serious. Bronchitis, hypercook, something I can't pronounce, acute heart failure, chronic heart failure, atrial fibrillation. She went last week for back pain, lower back pain. This week, today is uh, I, so blood pressure, diabetes. These are a lot of things. It's very serious. This is serious stuff. And you tell me, okay, cool. These things, is, and I, everybody have issues everybody because people with AIDS in the club wiggling like it ain't nothing. But at the same time, this is what I'm saying. Don't sit up here and say, okay, cool. I have these issues. Help me. Give me your hard-earned money. That get, unfortunately, I didn't fraud for this time. So if you is doing that and you don't take onus of your own situation, this is the onus you have to take before you ask your people for help. You're saying help me because they're not. But you haven't taken onus of it yourself. So listen, the first onus is this. You're telling me you can't tell your doctor, send your paperwork to your GoFundMe to pay for your heart transplant. That's the first onus. That's not even something that social media can help you with. That's something that a lawyer can help you with. Because not only do you have a lawsuit on the doctor, you have a lawsuit on the hospital, his insurance, and whoever whoever gives him a check. Because at his at this point, he's supposed to send your information, whether it be confidential or not, with your permission to whomever you choose. So let's not be um let's not be foolish about that. So that's number one. Number two, your onus is this. You have a lot of things wrong with you according to what you're saying is your medical problems. Your onus is saying, I want to live for my child. Well, let me do what I can to help ensure that I stay alive as long as possible. Go to my doctor visits, take my medication, don't drink and smoke as he asked me to. Not let me promote a smoke out and go to the club and get tipsy and wiggle all over. Yes, have your fun. If there's nothing that can happen, have your fun. But take onus is what I'm saying. I want to live for my children. You heard me? The doctor told me, if I don't lose weight, I'm going to have diabetes or whatever, whatever. So I have to do something about that. If I don't, I can't come to y'all and say, listen, send me money because I'm fat. Give me a tummy tuck. No, bitch. Stop eating fucking... <laughs> no, bitch. Stop eating... <laughs> Lil' Depp is like he's going out of style. You feel what I'm saying? So stop being stupid. Stop being crazy. Stop saying this and that. Just because somebody says something, that don't mean it's what it is all the time. And guess what? This is another thing. GoFundMe is a perfect platform for people who are going through stuff to uh, to get the help that they need when something is happening. GoFundMe is a platform, but they built their platform on this too. You know what they built their platform on? Receipts. I can't just post on GoFundMe, oh, bitch, I'm about to die, send me money. No. They want to see receipts. They want to see facts. They want to see these things. They want to see all this stuff. They want to see what's going on with you before they say, okay, just whatever, whatever. So guess what? If those people felt, if those people who is their job, this is what they do. GoFundMe is a platform of, listen, this is what they're saying on GoFundMe. This is why you can trust GoFundMe. It's a crowdfunding platform that allows people to raise money for events raised for life events, such as celebration graduations, to challenging circumstances like accidents and illness. But they built their platform on this. 
you can trust me because I'm going to make sure that nobody playing with your hard-earned money. I'm not going to let nobody pay with your home. We're going to make sure that they got the proper paperwork and things that they're talking about before you give them your money. And we're going to make sure that they got the right thing that is attributed to what they talk about. That's what GoFundMe is. So at the same time, this is what I'm saying. If the GoFundMe, who is a platform that built on making sure that before you give somebody your hard-earned money, that you uh, that they, the, what they're asking for for is actually factual. If that's how they built their platform and they took you off of there, what is the two asking us for now? Now, if they took you off there wrong or bad, let's look into that. Let me help you do that. So do not blame me and say, oh, it's shaggy for now. If you die, no, it's your doctor who you would, did not take the onus of telling him, send my shit to them people, man, so I could get my home. Your doctor saying it's confidential, but it's your information. When they ask you for simple stuff about what's going on. So I do not think Tutu did nothing wrong. I don't think I did nothing wrong. If you think I did something wrong, it's easy to block me. It's not that serious. If you don't like it, Block me. People do be lying on GoFundMe, but the part of it is to say, okay, cool. We're going to look into it to make sure that it is what it is. So as far as you don't know what to believe, this is what I'm saying. Like, sister, if this is the case, if you are going through this, I would love to help you. I would love to help you. But there's some things that just not making no sense. Somebody still across the desk, the day you said you went to the hospital for this, you was at the club that night shaking your ass, and that's not just, I don't, I look, I, I'm not, I don't know. I don't know. I look into it some more. You promoting smoke outs. You're drinking. You're in class like it ain't nothing. This day, this day you went to the hospital over there. You went, I don't know what's going on. I don't know what's going on. I don't know. So at this time, what I came on to do is to make sure that you was being accurate for what you're telling. Because what you're asking us for is not just prayers, which I'm going to pray for anyway. I pray for everything. But you're asking us for money. You're asking us for money because she said, here. This is my cash app. If you go to her page, she has her cash app up as well. That is her cash app. Please send me money. This is what she's asking for. She's asking for prayers. But she's also asking for money. So as far as it's going down, when you ask me for, when you come on my show, which is the message show that everybody knows, this is messy. Hey, this ain't Oprah, this Jerry, bitch. This ain't um Ellen. Bitch, this ain't Ellen. This ain't fucking Steve Harvey. This is Maury. Bitch, this is Wendy Williams. This Jerry. This is Maury. This ain't Oprah. This ain't <laughs> this it ain't what this is what it is. This is what it is. This is Maury. This is Jerry. And this is Wendy Williams. Put together with green hair. That's what this is. Everybody know it. It's no secret. If you wanted help, when nobody would question the help, and nobody would just people just feel sorry automatically and just go send it, you should have went to oh, you should DM Oprah, DM Ellen. She helps people. <laughs> DM Steve Harvey. DM them people. Don't DM Shaky because what I'm going to do is look and ask, bitch. I don't do fraud anymore. I ain't did fraud since 2007. So, bitch, every nickel that I get, I, I had to work hard for. So when you act shaky for that nickel, when you act shaky for that nickel, bitch, you better be right. That's all I'm saying. So if y'all don't like it, block me. It's so simple. You don't have to see it. It's easy. This ain't Dr. Phil either. So when you come and say, listen, help me, text me, this is my cash out. Go for me, took my shit down. I'm like, we, 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 let me go see, go for me, tripping. If you having that, you want me to tell the tippers, oh, hey, oh, hey, send this girl some money. And the second they see, is, and so this is what it is. Y'all looking at this, this is what happened. So let's say I don't do no research. I don't look into it. I should have, I, I don't do no research. I don't look into it. I don't say nothing. I said, well, let's just help her. Let's just try to help her. Y'all, let's, we, we, we ride up. We, the simple support. I don't care what nobody says. I know one thing. The simple, my true simple is going to send this girl money. 
they was going to send it. If the cash app was up there, the money would have been sent. Period. They don't ask questions. But guess what? They just sent, somebody sent $100, $50, $20, $30, whatever, whatever. Your hard on money. You got kids. You got bills. You got pops. Y'all have sent her this money. She'd have had this money. And Sunday night, she'd have been at the D shop. And they had to come up there. What y'all have say? Well, Shake it told us to send us money. Shake it told us to send us money. Now, if she do happen to pass away, and I, we all got to die, and I pray to God that this never happens. I hope she live a wonderful and beautiful life. I really do. That's on, on everything. But at the same time, this is what it is. If people have looked into it, and there's nothing that we can find to corroborate what you're talking about, and you're asking for our hard-earned money, you have to be under, understand that when I'm looking for receipts, and the only one I can find is this one. That's the only one I can find. You know, you know what I'm going to do. I'm going to look into it. I would see, this is what I was looking to. This is the part that fucked me up. Why go for me? Took you down. They tripping. You have a congested heart there. You got all your receipts. Why would they take you down? I would like to donate money on GoFundMe. I would like to, you know, I'm, you know, I, 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 for me, cash app don't work. Right now. Anybody know me? Knows. So this is not like I said. This ain't. So if you wanted sympathy for nothing and didn't want nobody to check and look into the situation, sister, you should have went. Off. You should have. You should have called Tutu, because y'all know Tutu was gonna call me. You should have called Oprah, Ellen, Dr. F. They'd help. Not shake. Because I'm going to look into it. If you asking me for a nickel of mine, a nickel, what did you need it for? What is you going on? Ain't no more. Why they didn't get like, so, so, what up? All, and it just wasn't, as from everything I'm seeing, all the research and all the stuff I did, it wasn't adding up. I don't know if she lying, but you can't fault me. You got to fault your doctor. Then that's how I feel. Many people, you need some hands. <laughs> well, I'm sliding my DMs. People that I have talked to, people that she went to school with, I have talked to people that she goes to school with, and the dates not there. I'm really seeing the date she went to the hospital, and then the, and the same thing. So, so the, she, she sent me all her hospital dates and stuff, and there's some stuff on there. Like, wow, you're complaining about this. But then the same day you post that, this is what you post. Bye. Wait, hold on, I'm confused. Who is what is about? What is this? What is uh, going on? A lady came on the live early and told us okay. that she that the doctor told us she had one month to live. I said, baby, the doctors don't know shit. God goes whatever, whatever. She said, Well listen, um, if you can, you know, help Oh, me. this is the girl who got the health problem. Right. Wait, okay, so wait, it 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 came it comes to be a lie? Is that's what's looking like because the stuff that she's complaining about heart failure heart attacks and stuff like that is stuff that hospitalizes you for periods of time and so what happened was we we I, in looking at it the numbers wasn't adding up because in one post she asked it for this amount one post she asked it for that amount and one post the go all right was, okay, okay okay not to cut you off i ain't got a they, phone call go ahead so I've been saying this for a while, and it's been like for some months now. And I was just about to like, you know, someone telling me do it, someone telling me no, some, someone just pulling me back away from it. You get what I'm saying? No. And I've been like, okay, so I was about to give her, you know, a donation or whatever. I was about to, I was about to donate her like about twenty or thirty dollars when I saw the shit. Right. But it just kept slipping my mind. But it was telling me pull off and go to it, pull off and go to it, like every time I see. It. And it's so crazy that if she having heart problems, I understand. If she, whatever she going through, I don't, I don't know what she going through. But she was working overtime. Like, that one really made me pull off from the situation when I saw her working, and she made, like, fucking, what? I think she made, like, 80 hours? I'm like, how is that possible? And you have heart problems. You get what I'm saying? She working overtime. And that's her at the D-shop, shaking down when she's supposed to be having you know what? congestive heart failure, two heart attacks, bronchitis, diabetes, hypertension, the list goes on. I got all the receipts. I got all the receipts. Mm, I, got mm, mm, mm. I got all the receipts. It's not funny when people playing 
on playing on whatever the case may be. Because oh, I I I, I like her and all, but I don't know if that she was the scam people out money. I don't know. I don't know. Hold up, congestive heart failure. What about needing a heart transplant? That don't hospitalize you. Your heart not pumping blood. That don't that so that don't hospitalize you. You tell me your heart don't pump blood, but they say okay, go ahead, you can go run the disease shop today. What are you talking about? Make it make sense. I don't care what nobody say. That just don't make sense to me. And guess what? If I'm having heart failure, that's cool. And I won't go shake my hands, cool. But the next thing, I'm not going to do it the, the next morning. Y'all send me some money. And another thing, if they knew about our health problems, like, okay, you, you got all this on social media, but you working. How, and that's, that's, that's affect your job. You cannot work while you have a health failure. You can pass out on a job. You can do anything, and you go for them. So if you, I know is, black people if you is going through that, and you won't go out and shake your ass and stuff like that, cool. That's you. I love you. Do you. But don't stay shaking. You need to send me money. Are you wrong for questioning why I asked you to send me your money? Or why I question why I came on your live and ex why I came on your live and ex your sippers to send me their money? No. Wow. No. Oh, man. If she want to have fun, that's cool. But then don't ask me for some... You the same energy that you say here. How much she asked you for? How much you asked? How much she asked me for a particular amount? She said, "Listen, tell if anybody." She sent me a cash app and said, "If anybody want to donate, this is what it is." Because like they took the GoFundMe down. And so if the GoFundMe, if the GoFundMe took her down because they never received proper documentation about her condition. Okay, then everybody so press and oh shy. They want to. That's the cousin. They say shy is the cousin. Shy rock and. What's going and on? me What's going and on? the queen. What's going on, girl? But no, real shit, that's really our cousin. That's really my blood cousin or whatever like that. Okay, what's the tea? The thing is, the whole situation, this is what I tell her. You got to eliminate something. You got to either eliminate God or you got to eliminate yourself. Because if you eliminate yourself, then you got to eliminate the people that's going to be around you. Because that's what they're going to be around you. Because that's what they're going to be around you. Because that's what they're going to be around you. Because that's what they're going to be around you. Because that's what they're going to be around you. Because that's what they're going to be around you. Because that's what they're going to be around you. Because that's what they're going to be around you. Because that's what they're going to be around you. Because that's what they're going to be around you. Because that's what they're going to be around you. Because that's what they're going to be around you. Because that's what they're going to be around you. Because you don't just get no heart overnight. You hear me? Right, you right. Don't. I agree with that. I agree with that's that. not nothing that you could just do. First off, they got a lot of people that's on the list to get a heart that need a heart way more than her. Right. Real shit. Right. So, at the end of the day, that's not... At the end of the day, she got to stop. Period. That's my real blood cousin. But she got to stop. She got to stay off of social media. Stay, stop going out. At the end of the day, stop putting that you going out. If you go out, you don't got to put that you going out because that Monday morning... You in a hospital crying. You can't do that. You can't do that. That's just some shit you can't do at the end of the day, and that's real shit. This, I'm G'd up. This, this, I'm this, too this, G'd up to not say what it the is. Truth, the fact, that's the real fact. shit. You got to eliminate something. So if this, you want the world to feel sorry for you, stop stop putting on the internet that you're going out. Smoke out and shake it down. Period. And that's real shit. And that's real shit, So You got to stop. Because look at this live, son. There's 600 people in the live, son. Look at everybody. Kevana, Kevana, no, this, I'm, this my real cousin. My little sister's in the live and everything. You got, to, I tell my cousin this every weekend, son. I'm about to see my cousin today at a party. Real shit. Do the doctors it's tell her? You got to eliminate. Do the doctors tell her it's okay to go out? Man, at the end of the day, ain't no, what, this what I ate. I, I look a real fast. I'm Right now, her sister. What doctor? Ain't no way no doctor gonna tell you you got a certain amount of time to live. What type of doctor is that? He don't even need the. He don't even need his fucking license. I agree. Cause if I got a certain amount of time to live, don't tell me that. You about to have me stressing. Right. That doctor. So that she doctor, needs a heart. Is what you're saying? That doctor is straight. That doctor shouldn't. She shouldn't be going to that doctor. So, cause at the end of the day, that doctor shouldn't be telling her, "Oh, you gonna die tomorrow." What type of doctor is they? Real shit. What type of doctor is they? I don't know. I just so the it, okay. that's this, under the, the doctor, comments. The doctor. Oh, she's she really she... sick. But the heart, as far as the heart, she do need a heart. But she's not number one on the top of the list that need a heart. They got people that need a heart for real. Right. For real. Look at Tyra. So, so, so the, the heart that she so listen. 
I'm the person that, of you taking onus of what it is that you're talking about. So if that's the case, why do she do you feel like she takes ownership and say, okay, I I might not be number one on this, but I'm gonna take care of what I got until I can get that. She has a son, correct? No, she let me tell y'all, she really that type of person that go for me shit. Man, my, my Elisha spray when Elisha spray trying to go get her car fixed with that. That's it. <laughs> Wait, what? Wait what? Girl, wait what? Yeah. Wait 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 wait. Oh, no, wait, wait, wait. no, that's no for real. All jokes to the side. Wait wait. Stop. All jokes to the Stop. side. Me personally, that's my cousin. I ain't donating. I'm just not doing it. You not doing it. I'm just not. I'm gonna be real, totally oh, honest with y'all. I'm not donating. So she trying now, to get that's y'all. If y'all donate, but I ain't doing it because you know why? I don't. Guess what, baby? I'm living off of my real shit. I'm living off of my. I'm living off of my boy. She wasn't being a hater. You just like, well, fuck, do you, sister? You collecting your money, baby? Do you? Do you? But, baby, that shot you should as well tell her real at all times. No real shit, though, for real. She really, she really is sick, y'all. She is she sick. Really sick. But the real situation, shit. but the situation is not as mandated as it's not deep. Because what I'm looking at, the doctor, she he have 20 years experience as a researcher and a clinician. I well, you know what? If it shake it, you a person as you a person that like to go beyond situations. And dig and everything. So, everything. Okay, if that's the case, tell her, let you bring her to the doctor. Real shit. I'm looking up the doctor information now. They're not going to give me information because it's HIPAA. It's Health Information Patient Privacy Act. But he can't keep it from her as the patient. She can get whatever she wants from him. And so that's the part that fucked me up. If go for me, ask for a piece of paper or something, a documentation, she, the doctor can't give it to her. I'm, I see the phone and the fax number. I'm looking up. I'm on the doctor page right now. I'm looking up. I'm trying to see where he come from, what his whole credentials is. Where is that everything. doctor A? I'm on the doctor page right now. I'm looking up all his stuff. He, he's a good doctor. He's not a bad Hold doctor. Hold up. My, my little sister wants you to air her. Tyra wants Tomboy 7 wants you okay. to air her. I know. Air her. <laughs> I looked. Oh, you know, I'm a dig. I'm a dig because it wasn't adding up. It didn't make no sense. I had to make it make sense. I'm not going to tell my siblings, oh, yeah, y'all send this girl money. And then next week you send a new car in the club. And y'all be like, shake, what the fuck wrong with you? No. 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 Well, how about that sound, like, girl? It's just not going to happen. If you try to get that car fixed, sister, why did you say that? I think that, I think my siblings would have helped you. Be like, bitch, I'm going to go back and forth. I'm really sick. It ain't as bad as what it is. I'm not about to. The doctor might not have said I had. I don't think this doctor here is. I don't know. But I don't think this doctor saying, oh, you got two seconds to live. I don't think that's him. I don't think he's that's him. Let me end it. Come right back. In. This doctor is a. He has a fellowship from both Baylor, LSU, 
and Southeastern University, and he has done transplant research at Baylor College of Medicine in Houston. No. This doctor is not a doctor that's going to not want you to get a transplant if you need to get a transplant. It's not happening. It's not. No, you got to make it make sense. I don't care what nobody said. What time? All right. Let me um, let me add Brazy right quick. Then we'll go into time. As soon as she sent me time. Time in. I call it time because that's what the is. Send me a message. You. So, um, sister. Yes. What's your take is on her? I told y'all, my team, I don't really know what to believe at this point. Like, it's not funny. It's funny, but it's not funny. Like, I, we be joking about her in class and shit because it's just, it don't add up. Like, she was tweaking for the first refund check to get her car fixed. Her car's still not fixed. Now your cousin just spilled the beans on you trying to use that money to get your car fixed. So is you really sick? Like, we understand you got these problems and stuff like that, but just give us the receipts. There's nothing wrong with you going out having fun doing your thing. Just show us the receipts to smack us in our face like, bam, bitch, I am sick. I'm just trying to go have fun and live my, my last days. Like, period. I believe she's sick. I'm sick. She has, med she has medical records of sickness. It's not showing diagnosis, but it's showing that she went to the hospital. But the we, day in she school, we in school for medical assistance. How do you not know your HIPAA rights? Your rights to get your shit. So they cannot get your stuff to nobody else. No, they can't get it. But you, you can get it. Go ahead. Right. Because see, this dude here, he has a fellowship as well as transplant research at Baylor College of Medicine. So he know how the process goes. Do you think her doctor, who has 20 years experience, would say, look, oh, I can't give go fuck with your information because it's confidential. No, he no, would say, well, listen, fill, like, fill out this phone. I feel like GoFundMe been having a crackdown on a lot of people because people take other people's stuff and try to make GoFundMe. That's why they're asking for the proof. Right. I feel like if it's, if it's really an issue, it's no problem with you getting the proof. It's your information. Right. And so not only that, the, if, if her cousin, her blood cousin come over here and say she's trying to get a car fixed, I believe she's sick. I do believe that. But don't come asking me for my heart I'm ready for your heart transplant and you really going to get your carburetor transplant. That's all I'm saying. <laughs> <laughs> That's all I'm saying. If you need your carburetor transplant, come on there and say that. Y'all be going back and forth to the hospital. I'm crying. Nowadays, nowadays, they got your medical workers so easy access to it. Like, all you got to do is log online. Like, you don't got to be in the hospital. You just log online and you can get the information. Just tell me this. Check in. I'm going back and forth to the hospital. I'm on the list somewhere. It ain't that serious right now. I'm and just trying to... She be up in class every day and don't say nothing. She just sitting in the back. Well, she just started coming back to school. She sitting in the back and don't say nothing. Like, but she get on internet on... Um, Instagram and she makes Google posts about us because we be basically jokes in a situation in class because what you don't know is you got people trying to actually set up put money together to give you you see what I'm saying like we really was gonna put money together to give her but bitch when the, the shit started not acting up who about to get my hard earned money um no ma'am pam period we'll do we don't do fraud no more we don't do it no more we don't do it I don't even see how she because she barely comes to school. And then I'm like, if you go, if you gotta work and all of this, ain't nothing wrong working. But when you got medical and health conditions, they only limit you to a certain amount of hours. They don't overwork you because it's gonna you're gonna be a liability at that point. If anything happens to you on a job, you're a liability at that point because they know that you sick and they cannot overwork you like that. So how can you work eighty hours, my girl? How can you? I don't know. But I know one thing. I don't know what that. Or oh, in that video of her shaking, that was me. I, I, I sent that to him because he girl, asked. Girl, girl, I saw her at the D shop. I another was... classmate that was um another classmate <laughs> saw her at a DJ. Asked her was she okay. The other classmate that's what I said. She was she was supposed to have a mask on. She was contagious. Like we contagious to her, but she not contagious to us. We saying all type of stuff. Like she really believe her and like you know. She be sending a lady pictures or whatever like that. So the partner, they kick it. Cool. But bitch, when I see you at the D shop and you all over some dudes and you spread it all over the all over the car shaking, you don't look sick to me, baby. My heart bad and all that. I'm gonna right. have my fun, but I'm gonna have my limits to my fun. Right, I ain't right. saying don't live your life. Live your life. But you gotta have your limits. But if you so live your you, life, what you gonna do? If, if you gonna be at a club on Sunday, don't stay shaking, send me your twenty dollars. But then, let me tell you, when, soon after she was in, after she left the D-Shot, she was in the hospital because she said she had fluid in the legs. 
But the doctor got her on fluid pills. Let me well, ask she, that. again, she tell us all of this stuff at school. And I, I believe she has some sickness, and I think her car broke, and I think she should just say, Look, <laughs> her I'm, car is broke. I'm sick. She was supposed to get it fixed with the first refund check. I, she could have came and said, y'all, I'm sick. Help me with my car. And guess what? I ain't lying. I owe my mom. I don't probably listen to it. And ain't nothing wrong with that because it's like, okay, she needs transportation to get back and forth. I got yeah. this woman. We would have probably accepted that. I would have sent this woman. I would have sent this woman. I would have sent this I would have sent this I swear to God. Oh, everything. Yeah. Now, but, 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 I'm, but don't come tell me, oh, I'm about to die. Then one six thousand, one five thousand, one eight. Eight thousand, and it costs for I don't know. It's so much. <laughs> it costs about three hundred four thousand dollars. Tell me the truth. We about I'm a this, and I keep telling y'all. Let me uh, let me add fancy. Let me see what's going on. Let me see who's going. On. This ain't her cousin. That's not her cousin. She this is her classmate. All right. Go live. Go live. <laughs> What's going on? Hold on, for shaking. I'm at work. Let me tell y'all. First of all, for all y'all saying family ain't shit. Let me tell you, I got five sisters. Shaky, shot is friendly. Shot is a friendly. That's not our blood cousins. Those girls was just raised around us since we were small. My grandma took care of them, so that's not our blood cousins. Still and all, real is real. You can't be on social media you're doing that shit. You going out? You're, you're in the hospital. You need a heart. You need a heart, then the next day you're drunk. Like, that shit don't match at all. So, in Brittany, Booth, you keep on saying, what, what, what she doing? She begging people for money. She doing too fucking much, and this shit gonna get exposed. And I'm happy it got exposed. Y'all, all y'all saying family shit. Man, fuck y'all. Fuck y'all. <laughs> Shake it. Fuck your sippers, because they're tripping right now. Really, it's not all about sippers, girl. Really, that ain't real, about sippers, Some of the people just in here, girl. Listen. <laughs> listen. I'm not gonna say she not sick. But she not sick to what she need a heart. She don't need no heart. Right. Okay. She don't need no heart. Listen, right. I, oh, shake it. I'm sick. And I don't go to the hospital or nothing. Like, I be passing out and everything. Like, right. I don't, you know, like. Right. Man, so this, so, so everybody this, saying they feel bad for her. Don't. Like, it's a fucking joke, period. It's a joke. Like, y'all toe up. So if y'all go down Elisha page, go look at go look at uh, every put every picture she used to post. I used to be under that bitch saying, "Just die then," because the <laughs> shit a joke, son. Real talk. So do you think? So the, so listen. So the 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 part about hugging her coffee, that's is that accurate? That's what it was. Yeah, you see, she started school too. I would, see, and, I, and and this is the part I'm having problems with. I believe she's sick. And I would have loved to help her. If you just could be real. Look, in the look. head. That girl not sick in the heart. She's sick in the head, not in the heart. I would love for you to come and say, listen, I'm going back and forth to the hospital. My car broke. I'm trying to go to school. Shake it. Tell you slippers if we can send me a little something. I promise you. I would have I would have done that on, on my mom. So before y'all think I'm so heartless. But the truth. Yo, I swear to God, this morning, I put this on everything I love. That girl made a post and said, Roses are red, violets are blue. I'ma die some, some, some. I told her delete that. I told her delete that. I, that shit embarrassed it. Right. And if I was her sister, I wouldn't even be on here trying to fuss with people because that shit is embarrassing. That right. shit is embarrassing, son. Right. That's why I don't fake claim me as no cousin or none of that. It's 2019. If I ain't know you when I was a child, you're not my fucking cousin. If you, you, I don't got no play cousin, son. Real right. talk. Right. Real, real talk. Yeah, man, die. Like, nigga was tired of you. You're, 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 you're going out. You're at the D shop. Then the next day, you're in the hospital acting like people recalling you. You got for Listen, when I go to the hospital, just in the emergency room, they put that shit on my nose, too. So she be making it seem like she on the oxygen tank and shit. Like, yeah. man, that's fucked up. Brittany, what you mean what she do? I don't know what she did, but she asked people for money, so now they exposed her. So. Yes, and, and, and the part about it is, it was like, this is the part. It would have, it I, I think I might have. You know, I was in a good mood today. I wouldn't even really care much. But the part was she like, GoFundMe took me down. And the only GoFundMe only going to take me down if you don't send them the stuff that they need to release your money. Like, they need the proof documentation of what you're saying is accurate before they release right. their money. Because that's what they build their platform on. They want you to know. So by them taking it out, something had to happen. So at first, I'm thinking, go fucking tripping. If this girl need a heart trip, why the fuck y'all don't want to give her money? So I'm not going to help her with Hold that. Hold up. Hold up. Oh, Brittany, what? you keep on saying what she do. You know what your sister do. Your sister is getting on social media, making an ass of herself. What you talking about what she do? 
Man, it don't matter. I always say all this. I said with you, man, it don't matter. She just look up. It's <laughs> Right. Let me add, let me let me let me add Josh right quick, and then I'm gonna add the sister. I'm gonna get yeah, add the sister. Get the sister on you. That's what I'm gonna. Say. Right. <laughs> Where's the sister? Where's the sister? Josh, I'm adding you. Sister, say something so I can pin you, so I know who to add you. I don't know. Say something. Sister. What's going on? Yeah, cool. Now, like I said, I don't I don't play with nobody in health condition or uh, uh, shit like that because you're not going for my own health conditions. Right. With, with, Diabetes, high blood pressure, and dialysis. Like, bitch, I need a fucking kidney. And I don't go around asking a big and for nothing. Because, bitch, first of all, you can't buy no organs. That's, that's, cut that shot first. Bitch, you can't buy no organs. Period. Right. All you gotta do is get on a list for it. And, like, I've been waiting on a kidney for, for two years, son. Two years. I don't drink. Yeah, I smoke my little weed, bitch, and I barely go out. But at the same time, I do gotta do this for my treatment so I can survive. Have you ever tried to put like a GoFundMe or something up at any point in time? What's that go? What's that go solve or prove? What, what I'm gonna do with it? I can't buy no fucking kidney. Right. I don't know. I can't pay for no. I can't pay for no for no for no treatments and shit. Like bitch, with my bag, bitch. I got my fucking dialysis bag right here. The Vita. Right. So how do you do? The government pay for that. Who pays for that for you? Insurance. Insurance. So do you have private insurance or is it government insurance? I have, but you're not in the healthcare. That's private. Okay. All right. So she might not have private insurance, like I'm assuming. Yeah. All you got to do is get a good insurance and it, and it go help. But like, like they say, you don't get a whole, a kidney overnight. You, you have to be on a list. And for, for to get a kidney, it goes by points. You got to be consistent with your treatments. You got to be consistent to take your medicine. You can't miss it. So, bitch, I'm just waiting. And I really can't find, I really can't find no, no, no matching type for my blood right. for me to get a kidney. So I, I'm, j I'm just waiting, me. You hear me? And I, and I, 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 be, I stay strong every day. Like, like I go through a lot of morning sicknesses. So as you going through this, what, what is your take on what she's, what she's, what's happening in this case? As far as she coming and asking for money, she tried to do a GoFundMe, but GoFundMe didn't release the money because. There's all people, people don't even take that serious for, for one. So that's why I never even attempt or even thought about doing nothing like that. Okay. I mean, she might not have the the help for for her uh her treatments and stuff, but that's nothing that Medicaid can't do uh, uh help you with. Okay. If she call, get a phone call, Medicaid, bitch, get a good some All right. insurance, All right. and they will help her with her treatment. Okay. Trying to buy a heart, you can't do it. All you can do is go on a list and wait. I, so I, I think if she's saying that. The doctor, she's saying that they, the, the GoFundMe didn't release the money to her because the doctor didn't send the information. But the doctor is a transplant specialist, so I'm sure he knows how this stuff goes. That's first of all, when you, first of all, when you when you when you get that, I'm gonna go get my patient. When you get diagnosed with anything, they give you forms, they give you paperwork. Or they give my papers. I, I keep my papers on. Be like I keep my papers. Oh, you get all this, see all that paperwork, yeah. paperwork, you know, diagnosis, hepatitis records, and all that. You get all that. Oh, so they, so she should have this if this was the case. She should have had it the first day she went to the hospital. Which all my, all my, let me show you. Let me turn my camera around. All my information, all my diagnosis, all that, right. all that. All that. So she I keep had, it on me. So she could have sent it in there herself. She didn't even need to get it from the doctor. No, she. First of all, the doctor's going to give it to you. They're going to give it to you. Right. They're going to give it to you. Like I, like I said, I don't think I don't think she's lying or nothing. But like I said, I don't think she's in need of a heart. Because if you could, if, if anybody, bitch, put alcohol or anything on the kidney, a uh, uh, heart that's toxic. The right. blood is toxic. Right. 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 It can't, it can't, it can't handle all that. But she is factual that she has went to the hospital and complained of certain things. The diagnoses are not clear at this point because she doesn't, she's never provided no document, no diagnosis receipts. But she have provided that she have went to the hospital. The only thing that was crazy to me was days that she went to the hospital. I'm seeing her posting, "What's up?" Uh, in the club, shake. It's like the days matching up, smokeouts and stuff like that. So this is it's this none, is the thing. It's none the, the, the go for 
what's wrong with you, but it, it's not a diagnosis. Right, right, right. It's not life threatening. Right, like you said, like like me, ever since I moved back down here, son, I was in the hospital for a whole week because they couldn't find me no facility facility to go to. I wasn't sick or nothing. They just had to treat me for my diagnosis in the hospital because I wasn't admitted in a facility yet. Oh, okay. And for a heart, she's supposed to still be in the hospital. Ain't no way that they can let you go for a heart failure because you could drop dead any time, any second of the day if you really got heart failure. And your like, heart. And, and Booth, that's what I'm saying, because Josh go out too. But that's what I'm saying. Cool. You cool. We love you and we'll pray for you. Come to the, come, I'm talking about for her. It's like, don't come and say, shake and send me your money. Tell your, tell your sippers, send me your, send me their money because I'm, I can't get help. I'm, they're not helping me, stuff like that. But you're not helping yourself. That's what I'm saying. Yeah, I go out, but I go out, but I don't be out every day of the week, every I weekend. And you, all and that. I never, but I never saw you ask for money either. That's why I said you drew up a slew code for me. I never saw you do that. No, I never saw you no, that. Because you, because you can't do that with the money. You can't. It's not going to help towards your health issues. Right. Unless you're trying to pay for treatments to be done. That's the only way I can see. But trying to get a heart and all that, it's a list waiting process. It's a list waiting, and it's a long fucking waiting process. Right. Like they said, if you're hard night, bitch, you do not need a hard bitch with a week before dying, bitch, you you don't need none that bad. Right. Do you think so? What's in your condition? Do you think there's gonna be an outlet soon, or you think you're gonna be a, get, getting a kidney soon, or do uh, you just have no? Idea? I mean, yeah, yeah, I'm on I'm on a list, but it just it's gonna take some time. I'm on a list. I'm on a transplant list, but it's just gonna take some time unless I find a fucking blood type match. And bitch, my own bitch is getting bigger by the by the treatments. Okay. Official. Okay. And so you take care of yourself, you go into your treatments, you're doing your own mystery treatments. Doing... I don't miss nothing. I take all my fucking medicine, all my blood pressure medicine, with my anxiety medicine when I wake up in the middle of the night, catch a panic attack, and all that. Right, right. Okay. Take my medicine. So like I said, I'm too young, bitch. I ain't trying to be on dollars the rest of my life and die early, bitch. I'm still young. I still got my whole life to live. Right. All right. Well, I appreciate you coming and tell your story. You heard me. Let me try to get somebody else to see what's going on. All right. All right. So, um, well, that's actual factual documentation I've seen on Josh. I, I mean, Josh's condition is well known. A lot of people know about it. It's not a, um, a secret condition um, as far as what's going on um, with with Josh's situation. I, 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 just, I, just, I just hit you, Boo Ready. I just hit you. So, um, so in the case of a young lady, a lot, Alicia, um, it has come to our attention that I think she's sick. My grandma went through what he going through. I pray. People too. I just um I think at least but I do think that I would have rather her just be honest with us. I think it might not be as serious as it is because of the situations that we are seeing. And people that are in close proximity to her have brought to our attention. Um, I would have appreciated, I'm trying to add you, Pooh Reddy. You got a press girl. Girl, Pooh Reddy. I do think she's sick. I do think she's sick. I'm gonna add the Dean so I can get Pooh Reddy on. I do think she's sick, but I don't understand. I don't think that, I think that she would should have been more honest with us and said, look, I'm sick. I'm on the list, I'm gonna get it one day, or whatever the case may be. But I just need help with my car. I need help with the I need help with food. Whatever the case is, I understand. Sticky. What's going on? Hey, she's sticking the motherfucker. That's the problem. Because if you didn't catch the cousins came in here and spilled the motherfucking tea, she's sick in the motherfucking head. That's what's going on because <laughs> well, she just played up, bitch, and went out the whole weekend. Oh, well, now she hurting because she shook down, got fucked like a dog, got drunk, bitch, and now she's sitting in the hospital because she hurting. And her bottom is hurting, bitch. Her bottom. <laughs> that dick was so good, bitch. It feel like a hump of the bust on her motherfucking chest. <laughs> Let's not do it, fish. She's sick in a motherfucking head, girl. It's a lot of crazy girls in New Orleans, bitch. It's what? a lot of us crazy hoes <laughs> in the city of New Orleans. Okay. Let's just not do it. What? Girl, the fish been following us for the minute. She been watching us for a very long time. <laughs> She has been watching us for a very long time. So if she had that condition going on, why was nothing been stated about it, Shaky? Come on, baby. Come this, on. She no, never no. been filing up all our pages. Now, it, now, there is posts about her going to the hospital. That is accurate. 
she has went to the hospital. Okay, I understand. It. Like I said, she's sick, but in her head. Shaky, if something was really wrong with that girl, Shaky, come on, baby. She would be in the hospital constantly. It wasn't no going out. If a bitch sick in their head, they're going to keep going over the same thing. Watch next weekend. I'm sorry, y'all. I apologize. She's going to apologize to everybody. To everybody. It's going to be apology or publish. Apology or pub uh, 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 apology, apology from her. Watch. You watch it. Okay. And then, then you're going to know. Girl, stop wrong with us. Something's wrong with us. Right. Because the whole time she was live with you, she kept saying, Shake it, yeah, because I was telling Tutu, I need to talk to Shake it. Why do you need to talk to Shake it? For what? For what? I kept saying, girl, something wrong with us. I can look and say something. Girl, I kept saying something is wrong with us. Something wrong with us, Shake it. Right. Uh, somebody did something to her. Somebody yeah. did something to her. Y'all, so she I, played with somebody and somebody did something. So I'm telling you. So I, I, don't know her, I don't know what her sickness is. I'm not a doctor. I know she went to the hospital numerous times. That is the actual factual. So something is, there's something going on here. Girl, um, me too. But I me don't too. know. Bitch, I, I was in the hospital constantly when I was in New Orleans. That's why I stayed in the hospital, bitch. You know, I was there. I stayed, the ex the hoes. I stayed and I went to the hospital. Yeah, girl, New Orleans would have you going crazy. Right. Period. As long as I ain't been that bitch, I ain't been worrying about I ain't been stressing, I've been living my life. Right. Period. Right. Period. Smoking my little weed, living my life. See, I ain't gonna lie to the girls. Bitch, when I was homeless, I was homeless. When I needed a rum, bitch, I needed a rum. Period. <laughs> Period, bitch. That's why I, that's why I get my disability. That's why I'm fighting for my disability. Right now, bitch, I get my disability. I know I know I'm fucked up in my head. Right. I know I'm fucked up in my head. I was a real crack baby. Right. A natural bone. Right. So listen, what is your take on this as far as the issue about the, the information about the car situation and her going doing the GoFundMe for the car, but they didn't release the GoFundMe because she wasn't able to provide the documentation. That Josh just went to his room and said, well, look, girl, here are all my documents right here. Diagnosed right. and everything else. Do you think right. do you think that is do you think that's act do you think that was the case or what? What do you think on that? She she didn't have her receipts. We needed to see her receipts. You know what I'm saying? You got to have your accurate documents. You know that shaky. Come on, now. Right. right. You, you know that lady was lying from the door. Right. She was at the hospital. They couldn't even show you a fucking nurse to to, to, her, to tell you. I'm like shaky. Tell her to call the fucking doctor. <laughs> tell her to call a nurse in that motherfucker. She in the hospital. <laughs> tell her to call the motherfucker. I say, God, now Shake it, not running this interview how it's supposed to go. This lady is in the hospital. I had You're a... supposed to make her call the nurses and the doctors so you can say, well, go get the doctor. I didn't need to see that. Okay. I, was, I had receipts in front of me. I had receipts of the, listen, you know me. Receipts of her what you say is, like, all her things. Thing. You had you know, all that. Diabetes. I you had that. all that. Then I had them. That she... Then yeah. I had her. Then I had the smoke out. Sure. Then I had the 5,000, the 6,000, the 8,000, the different numbers, the that. I had her in the club on the same night that the other thing was posted. I had all the receipts. I just need to, I, so I don't know what was going on. I need to know why is, what's going on, if you're being truthful to us. So I'm not tripping about you saying this is going on. Y'all pray for me. Girl, I will pray for you. Right. I will get on my knees and pray with you. That's how much I, I believe in the power of my grace. But what I will not do is send you my money, what you ask me. Right. Or tell somebody, or tell my siblings, send their money <laughs> that they work hard for. For real, for real, yeah, 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 yeah. And I totally agree with you. The full, the the, the full nine, the full nine. I totally agree with you because at the same time they're gonna look at Shaky like Shaky told us to send these people this money. You know what I'm saying? So at the right. same time, and I felt That's sorry for her. That's not what I mean. Because what's what's gonna happen is no, next, I don't somebody, ask for money. Somebody, do ask for added, money too. No, I don't ask for the money. The sister says she don't want to be added. She's gonna DM me later, and we'll talk to her when we talk to her. But I know one thing. This is what happened. I tell y'all, send some money. And then Sunday night, somebody sitting there at the D shop. Didn't we just send you $100? Guess what happened? That same $10, 20 my whole reputation. Well, Shaky told us, send this girl $10. Did what? <laughs> Bitch, I don't ask for money. I ask for donations. Period. I'm, I'm an entertainer. I'm a, Bitch, I'm the D. I'm an edge of tease, tease. Let me add tease. Let's see what's going on. Thank All you right. for stopping by Channel 69 News D. The sister said she do not want to be added. Y'all understand what I'm saying? She was, so she said she was DM me and we'll talk to the sister. About like I said, I believe she's sick, but I believe she wasn't being completely truthful. That's what I believe. If the, so, Boots, I would, let me see. Who teased us? I would love to, I would, I would, I the sister when the sister, I can't pick somebody going live. Yo, I don't comment on anything. But what I wanted to say was, I have had heart failure, right? Okay. 
and I've been on a heart transplant for 10 years now and I'm 34. But I uh I'm also my family like uh I'm born into it cuz my daddy have heart failure also. And he have like fibrillators in his heart and he's been on a heart transplant for over 40 years. Now the thing is, it depends on what doctor you go to. And if you ask for those diagnosed papers, now they give you like uh, your papers when you get like your discharge papers, which you diagnose with. If you don't ask for the, um, the papers, they will not give you that. So that might be the case of a person or whatever. On the other hand, is uh, like all illness is not the same. Like, cause I still go out and have fun, but I don't drink as much. I don't smoke, you know, but to each his own, you know what I'm saying? You never know what's going on in her head as far as what she needs to do. You know what I'm saying? Then she might, she probably be young. So it can be, it can be that too. You know what I'm saying? Those type of illness take an, a, a toll on you. Period. So you have, so let me ask you something. And I, the, this is the, the, the whatever. What is, so why are you on the list and all your medication? How are you paying for that? Medicaid. So Medicaid pays both of your money. Are you in Louisiana? What state are you in? New Orleans. Okay. I'm from so New Orleans. Medicaid pays for everything, part of it, all of it, some of it. Where? It pays for everything. If you have, just like uh, Josh said uh, about the coverage, if you have good insurance, you know what I'm saying, they help also. And you don't, and it be cheap. You know what I'm saying? You don't have to pay full, full, uh, Price for some of the medicine. It might be three hundred dollars, and you only pay thirty dollars for it. Gotcha. So my next question is: Have you ever did like a GoFundMe or ask people for money or donations or anything? Oh hell no, because it's up to God. <laughs> hell no. Right. Once you're on a heart transplant, there's no way you can pay for a heart. You have to be on that heart transplant for however long until they find you a heart. Gotcha. Or uh, whatever you need a uh. uh a transplant for it. You know, you be on that list until they're able to get you or uh, whatever you need. Your kidney, your heart, whatever it may be. You just can't go say, oh, I, I didn't did, uh, collect the $10,000, so therefore I'm going to pay for me a heart tomorrow. No, it don't go like that at all. Oh. It definitely do not. In that case, my dad would have been here a heart <laughs> since the 30s. Yes. You can't, no, because we're not saying that you can enjoy your life. What we're saying is, just you right. enjoy your life, whatever you want to do, that's cool. But don't no, say, okay, well, that. I'm going to enjoy my life. Now y'all send me some money. Now, that part, I do understand. You know what I'm saying? Don't be around here spending your money on nine cents and then go on live, well, go on the internet, period, and want somebody to feel sorry for you because you want sympathy for them to pay for anything that you need now. Your priorities and come first. I don't have a, and, and listen, sister, I don't have a problem. Just like you I come told us your issue. And you come and say, okay, this is what it is. But you say, listen, my car broke. Y'all sent me a couple of dollars. Guess what I would have did? I would have posted it and sent you some money. That's Wait, I understand the key. Oh, my car, my car broke. I need, I'll be uh, glad about it. Y'all know what it is. And you can live your best life. But don't say, oh, I'm going to die in a month. Y'all send me money now. And then this not be the case. I don't know when you're going to die in the law but how does she know that she's going to die in a month? Who told her so? Because, no, 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 no. Because I have hypertension, too. I have, hyper, I, have other, I have other problems with me also. And my doctor ain't never say, oh, well, you got three weeks to live. No, that's not, no, that's not how that works. You're going to keep taking your medication. Now, if the medication not working for your body, they will switch for some um, something stronger. Or whatever, but if that don't work, then something else have to be wrong. You know what I'm saying? So they they're just not gonna be like, oh well, you you gonna die in three weeks? No, 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 not from no heart failure. Come on, no, that's not how they work. Right. Yeah, well, that, thank, that you, was... thank you for coming. Thank you for coming and sharing uh, your story. Uh, I appreciate it. Um, All right, thank you. Thank you. Thank you so much. All right. Love you. Um, I'm, I, I just requested you, ready, girl. What's T-Sister? 
Too ready to get out of box, girl. Get out of box, sister. Get out of box, sister. Too ready to get out of box, girl. I'm trying to age you for help. The fuck real, man? <laughs> it's fuck real, man. What's down, bro? What's going on, bro? What's going on? What you got going on? Man, I, I'm just going to say this. Like, like, you don't know how people handle certain situations. You know what I'm saying? True. I agree. Because I was straight out the hospital. And I was at karaoke night. Because that's something that I like to do. Right. But you, uh, when did you ask somebody? Did you, go, did you start a go from me? I, I, would, I would never, ever ask that. Because I feel like. I'm a man, and um, my family, I, I can't, my family can't get it. I'm not about to ask no anybody for no money. All right, like so that. let me ask you this. Let me put it this way. If you had, a, if you started to go for me, if you did start right. to go for me, and you was asking people, help me out, would you, right. would, how would you, would you be contrite and taking onus of the situation, or would you be like, well, oh, thank y'all for sending me money, now let me go in the club and did it by. No, but I don't, I don't, I don't, I don't, I don't know, you don't know that, if she using that money for that, you know what I'm saying? She probably just, that's how she get away. I don't know because I, I, don't. I go to car I go to karaoke because that get me away from my grandmother, my mom. That's the way I just get away from the world. And you know of course, you, and of course, you didn't have something serious as heart failure. But if you nah, have, if you have something, it's, in, in your case, it's almost understandable. When it comes to somebody who's having two heart attacks, yes, heart failure, hypertension, blood pressure, right. a month to live. And if you want to go out there, fine. I agree with you. Go out, sister. You better have your fun. And I'll be right there with you, next to you, on the car, shaking my ass with you. But this is what I'm saying. And in the same breath, don't say, listen, they send me money. And in the fact that you set up a GoFundMe, but GoFundMe asked you for a few simple documents to v validate what you was talking about, but they took right. your stuff down and said, no, you don't. Have, you can't prove what you're saying is what you got. Nah, but I mean, I just, but everybody take and do stuff different, man. You know, I, I, I'm not going to just do it. Because I know, I know Lee, you know what I'm saying? And she was never... The type to scam nobody from my point of view, I really know her. You know what I'm saying? And I feel like she always been the type of person she needed. She, she, she was never like I know her personally. There's not no Instagram friend. You know what I'm saying? Who so I'm not gonna sit out here, huh? You know the girl personally? Yeah. And I, she okay. was never like that, son. I've been knowing her, son. Like it's, it's agreed upon that she have an issue, but some people are saying that the issue is not as serious as what she was making it out to be, and it may have been an issue for her to try to get her coffee. Go for me. Ask for do documents that. They're saying it's easily gotten by her. Right. That just, that's why they didn't release that money. So. I mean, yeah, that might be true, though. But and my so, thing is, though. And so, listen. So, do you think, so listen. Would you have, you, now nah, listen, I know you probably, like, you know, it, do you think it's right for people to ask, well, where is my money going? I, I, I believe so. They should because they if they gave it to you to do certain things with it and they feel like you're doing something else, you should be able to prove where you're using that money. Right. And so do you think it's fair for me to say, listen, I don't do, but you know, I don't do fraud. You know, I have a job. I actually go to work. I actually right. have kids. I have to actually have to take care of stuff and stuff like that. For me personally, you know that as me as a person. So right. is it fair? And I know you do the same thing because you have a child. So is it fair for me to say, well, if I tell you, Buster, I need $20 to go uh, put down this little boy booty on <laughs> Do you think it's right? <laughs> I mean, like honestly, for, we you can't really use it. You we can't use that situation. Yeah, I can't. Yeah, use you can't. Situation. Because no, because I'm gonna give it to you anyway. I, I wouldn't care. No, no. If I need twenty dollars and I tell you it's for games, but then the next thing you know, you see me take that twenty dollars and go and buy drinks for some buck naked punk. How would you feel? I'll be mad if you bought a punk a drink anyway. It, but okay, well, <laughs> it's, it's, the, the point I'm saying is this: if I tell you need twenty dollars for games. Where should that twenty dollars go? In the car. It should go what you said. Yeah, what you said. Go what I said it go. Right. That's where it should go. That's what I'm saying. So, yeah. don't, so, so if, but uh, what if I lie to you and say, "Well, first up, look, I got these, I got these high medicines that the sippers want to, you know, help me. I got, these, <laughs> I got. I'm about to start a group for me for you. I'm about to start a group for me for me. I got. I'm fat. I need a tummy tuck. Could y'all look? Somebody give me that. Uh, look, I'm, I'm I'm really broke up. Look, yeah, I'm about to show y'all. These are pill. Look, fractured and broke ribs. I got my, I got my receipts. Oh, I know. I seen it. With my, I saw <laughs> it. I saw it. So I'll um, go find me. When did they give that to you? They gave, um, they gave it to me Tuesday. Then I had, um, I had a surgery Thursday too. But it was just to clean up the scar tissue and stuff. That. Gotcha. gotcha. Yes, yeah, so you know. So, my uh, pain pill. I don't have no insurance, so I need help. <laughs> all set more. <laughs> So thank you for stopping by and giving. Yeah, me man, just man, add boots, man. Boots got some stuff to say. Add boots. Son. I think she told me she was good being it, but I man, boots in your fussy. She need to get on your add boots. Uh, 
add boots to tutu because they the ones up here cutting up. All right. All right. No, so Eruby, this is not for views, sister, because let me show you. I'm going to show you how much I don't care about views. I'm going to block you so you don't see it. So now you don't see it, sister. So I don't care about views. I want the views to go down. I want them to go down. I want less people here. <laughs> I want less people here. That's just one less. I'm a, it's not for views. I'll block a bitch in a second. I don't want nobody. <laughs> we talk about some serious stuff. This is not making no sense. It's not making no sense. It's not making no sense. I don't do it for views. I'll block you. So the, the, now I, I, that's one less view. Sister, I give views anyway. I don't even shout. <laughs> I block you. So now I don't get the views. Oh, my views go down. It went down by one. <laughs> it certainly went down by one. Um, so um, I don't know why it's a twin. I don't know. It's not good. Let me see. Let me add. I'm trying to add pool ready or two two, and I don't think this is better than go to girls. Oh, it's not better than go to girls at all, bam. You could possibly never. You could never get Dorothy, Blanche, Rose, and Sophia, sister. You could never get it. So, um, no black and shaking. Child, no, she said I'm doing it for views. Um, I'm not doing it. Not no more. I'm, <laughs> you hear me? Oh, there goes two right there. So, uh, so you can't say I'm doing it for views. I'm going views, I'm, I'm, I'm to drop them. I'm going to make them go down. <laughs> Now how the fuck I'm wrong? This bitch talking shit too too. This, this bitch playing with me, girl. I'm not scared of no one named Mammy, bitch. What bitch you mean? trying? She mad at me. I don't know what this so mad at me for talking about because you know my, you know my uh, you know my sister, bitch. Yeah, I know your sister. Ask your sister how I've been trying to help her. Fuck wrong with you hoes. You hoes need to get shit understood. Bitch is always playing with people. Bitch nigga ain't say nothing. Bitch I ain't say nothing bad about this girl. Bitch, all I did was try to help her. You did. You tried Bitch, to help. You what I came to you and say, let's put an event together for her. What's no. wrong with hoes? If y'all gonna tell it, tell the fucking truth. Bitch, keep you, saying something, bitch. You, keep playing with me, bitch. You gonna need that gun because I'm gonna make you eat them bullets, bitch. I'm she, tired of these hoes playing with me. She sent, she sent, you sent the money as well. Yay! How the fuck I'm doing something wrong? I'm messy. Bitch, I'm checking on you. I'm making sure you straight. How the fuck I'm wrong? Dude, How I'm I'll, wrong? Bitch, I've been reaching out to you. How I'll the say, fuck I'm wrong? How I'm against you? It's, it hurt my feelings to know that this shit not real, though. Because, fuck, I be thinking about people that's really going through shit. And all I do be trying to, all I've been trying to do is help people. Like, how the fuck I'm wrong? Bitch, I barely got and I be trying to make it my business to help others. Bye. Fuck. I don't got a call, bitch. So, bitch, I'm sending you money. I don't have a call, but I'm making sure you straight. So the fuck I'm a bad person. People is fucked up. People is really fucked up. Girl, sister, I know where your heart and your intentions were because you come to me, the first thing you said, well, when we going to do that event? You didn't ask me. You ain't tell me what it was or not. You say when we go do the event. That's the first thing you say. That's all I did when I came to you. I ain't come. I ain't come say nothing crazy or negative. All I said was, "Come on, we could do it. You want me and you gonna do it? I want to do an event for." And you, man, you start elaborating after. And that. I said, I said, well, I don't know if she's being accurate. Let's look into it first because something's not adding up. And so we looked into it and we got some more information. And so the, the more information that I'm finding is that she was not being accurate. And so I don't have no, and I don't have no empathy or sympathy for somebody that's going to come and lie if that's the case. I don't know if she's lying, but I'm saying the proof is leading toward her lie. You're not going to say, Shaggy, do this for me. Tell your people, send me money. You send money, tell people to send me money, and you're lying about something. That don't make no sense. Because all you have to do is say, sister, I'll be going back and forth to the hospital. My car broke. Can you help me out? Bitch, I would have posted. Without hesitation, out of the debate, without hesitation. But don't come and say, oh, I need it, I'm about to die tomorrow. Blah, 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 et cetera, et cetera. And that's not the truth. So don't tell me about having so sympathy. This ain't, I'm not Oprah. I'm not going to just say, oh, well, let's just buy everybody a car. I'm not Maury. I'm, just, I'm not uh, Ellen 
Oh, every, we're going to take everybody to Cancun. I'm not Dr. Phil. Let's make it right. I'm not Steve Harvey. Let me send you to the college. I'm not none of that. I'm shaking. I'm going to look it up. Bitch, I work hard for money. And I understand. I feel so sorry for everybody that, I, when I was scamming, I, I didn't understand that. I understand it now. I understand everybody in here that do work hard for this. But that's the first thing they right do. First thing you're going to say, bitch, you're going to shoot me because you know you can't handle these hands. Bitch, y'all know y'all can't handle these hands. That's why you always want to use weapons and shit on me. Y'all not going to fight me fans. What? Fake ass hoes. Bitch, you stay a gun. Bitch, how you going to shoot me? Bitch, I was trying to help your sister. All I told you, you sitting up here in, un entertaining this. Bitch, you need to be by your sister's side. I'm not about to be on the fucking internet if I know my sister ain't lying. Man, fuck them people. I'm going to go off and send my piece and then go be by my sister's side. That's where the fuck I'm going to be at. Hoes got shit fucked up in the membrane. And at the end of the day, you send your, you work hard for your money. You sell your shoes. You do, and you, you, sell, and you know what I'm saying? So this is what you do. You took out your pocket and give to the homeless. Out your pocket. Out oh, my pocket, exactly, bitch. Where I was trying to be, if I'm so busy trying to be a bad person to tear somebody down, bitch, come on now. You know what's up with me, shaking. You know from my, you know my heart. You know the real person I am. You right. know that's me. That shit just pissed me off because, bitch, I've been helping this girl. That make me feel some fucking type of way because I know I was, I was coming from my heart. heart. That's what the fuck. But, that's and, why and I feel some and, fucking and you, type and of you way. Not, and you not wrong. For asking, where is my money going? I ain't tripping about giving. Just let me, don't, just tell me where, let's tell me what it's for. If it's, if it's, if it's for the, whatever it's for, I don't know what it's for. If it's you to go have a good time, tell me that. I respect that. Look, I'm sick. I just want to go have a good time. Girl, here, your, here girl, go have a good time on shake. Have fun. Just tell me the truth. I respect that more than I respect anything else. The truth is the only thing I'm really acting for. So don't just make it like we cracking down with people that's sick and all that stuff like that. No, if you sick, if you sick and you're lying, I don't fuck with you. If you're sick and you're, if you're, uh, if you're ugly and you're lying, I don't fuck with you. I ain't got nothing against sick people. I ain't got nothing against ugly people. But I got sick of people that's not telling the truth. If you got a billion followers and you're lying, I don't fuck with you. If you got two followers and you're lying, I don't fuck with you. It don't matter. I don't give a fuck about a person, but I give a fuck about a liar because I live in my truth. Guess what? If you gonna get my coins, or you gonna get my stuff, you gonna get anything from me. It's just being your truth. So don't worry about that. You're not doing nothing wrong if you're giving the truth. So I don't know what the situation is, but all I know is this This is what happened. You're saying this, but everything we're getting is this, and that's not adding up. And all we asking, make it make sense. We ain't come on here with brass shoes and like we're not making it make sense. Make it make sense. But you can't make, if you can make it make sense, hey, cool. We good. Here your coins, Ellis girl. Go out and shake your ass with the best of them. In fact, you could come in the event I got for free. But at the same time, don't sit up there and be like, oh, well, I need it for this and that, but in your mind. No, really that's, not, that's not the reason why I feel some type of way. I feel some type of way because I know my heart, man. I don't never want to see nobody. I don't give a fuck. You could be my enemy. I don't want no. I don't never want to see nobody down. I'm not gonna never want to not try to help somebody. Bitch, I'll try to help you before I try to help myself. And I don't like that shit. And for this to be like, it's it's really disappointing and it hurt my feelings because man, I really I'm really out here trying to help her. Like that shit pissed me off. Like that shit blew me. Like that shit really hurt my feelings for real. Like, Cause I know. I really meant good. Like, I really was trying to help her. Like, real shit. And I felt bad because she started talking about her child and stuff. And that shit just hurting my feelings. It just really hurting my feelings. And for her to just be on here. And if she lying like that, you don't do that. You don't play with people because people be going through stuff too. My mama going through shit too. Like, my mom, you know, and I be seeing people with their fucking problems and stuff like that. I'm not saying I'm trying to help the world, but I just, it just, I try. Like, that shit hurt in my feelings. That shit hurt in my heart. Like, and you sitting up, and then your sister, she's sitting up here fucking entertaining dumb shit. Like, man, you entertaining this gonna be by your sister's side and shit, man. Fake ass hoes. These hoes fake, but y'all sitting up here portraying y'all have a heart, y'all this, y'all that. Man, y'all can't be too much having hearts and shit like that. Yeah. 
That shit just blew me, son. That shit really blew me. 